I knew it. I knew it. Tower of Fantasy is popping off. I said it all along. I said it. I predicted it and it's happening, which means I can see the future. No, I can't. But look at this. 70,000 people watching Tower of Fantasy. The game is three hours, 36 minutes away from going live. And there are 70,000 viewers like Envy streaming it. Asmongold mentioned it. Over 4 million registrations. Tower of Fantasy is popping off and I'm so glad because it's really, really good. How do I know? So I've been playing, I played the closed beta. I've been playing on Asia server since just after the closed beta. So this will be my third time around in Tower of Fantasy. I kid you not. So I thought I would make a quick video here. Things I wish people had told me as I started playing Tower of Fantasy. The TLDR. It's better than Genshin Impact. Um, I mean, in some ways it is. I'm not even kidding. In some ways it is. All right, so lots of events. I haven't logged in uh, on Chinese server for a while, so there's probably some goodies for me here. So this is Shiro. This is my favorite character. Uh, as you can see, I've unlocked her Space Kitty skin. So the first thing I wish people would have told me, it took me a little while to find this, is... Okay, let's do some quick overview. So weapons and characters are tied together. When you pull a weapon, you get a character. So this is Shiro's weapon, the Chakram of the Seas. Here you go. You can see this is Shiro and her weapon. You get them both. So when you pull on a gacha, you'll get the weapon and the character together. What I didn't realize as well, though, is when you refine this thing, you get multiple copies of it, right? You can see I've had four extra copies. All right, so basically, uh, these balls are additional copies of the weapon. When you've refined it to... There we go. Oh, it is. It's in a different screen. It's under imitation. My bad. That will probably be called Simulacra in the English version. It was on the closed beta. Anyway, under Simulacra, imitation, whatever it's called, this is basically your appearance, what character you're uh, equipped with. It works just like a skin. So whatever level you're at, your character will be at. So you don't have to level your characters up, but you do have to level your weapons up. When you refine this thing three times, you unlock an extra skin. So that, I wanted to do Space Kitty here for Shiro because it's just the funniest thing ever. Rollerblades, Space Kitty, who who wouldn't want that, right? Um, so, yeah, when you get the third copy unlocked, you will unlock a new skin. However, new players, beware. As tempting as this is, I've fallen for this trap twice. Do not hyper-focus on that, because if you do, you'll, you'll struggle to get the matrices to level your weapon, and you will find yourself very underpowered very quickly and in a bit of a hole that you can't get out of at least i have twice now so that's why i'm warning you now anyway so what was i saying yeah don't spend this on this and the reason why is you also need to pull for these these are your basically like your genshin impact uh artifacts right you put them on your weapons they make you big and strong brilliant you need good ones gold ones like these uh, they only come every 40 wishes, so you need to keep wishing on this to make your character big and strong. Otherwise, you will fall behind like I did. Uh, level 68. So I'm at level 68 right now, and I still don't have them. Let me just show you. It's very difficult to get them um, without wishing on the gacha. Uh, now, I don't know. It may be different in global. Maybe there'll be some events that give things out and stuff. But certainly, I mean, I've been playing for a while now on China. And it's very difficult. It's been very difficult for me to get these. So yeah, basically, uh, you equip these on your weapons. Where are they? Okay, so here is my Chakram of the Seas, for example. I still don't have a. I've got a two-piece Shiro set, which is nice. So it took me ages to get these, by the way. And this is the only weapon I've really managed to do it on. Uh, but I don't have a two-piece. I've just stuck these on for now because at least they're five stars, so they level up a lot higher, so they're better. But really, I should have at least two of these to do to get like a two-piece bonus set. But I've only got one, so I'm not activating that. And I've only got one, so I'm not activating that. Ideally, I think I want a two-piece Samir set. I want another Samir one here. I still haven't been able to get it at level 60, whatever I'm at. So yeah. Definitely just save your currency for the Matrix Banner until you've gotten all these. Let me change weapons a second so you can see how poor. There you go. These are four stars. I managed to get one five star in there. This is my favorite weapon as well. And my third and... Yeah, my third favorite weapon, which is like my third in my third three weapon slots. Uh, they're still using four stars because I just I can't get these uh, as a, as a free-to-play on the Chinese server. 
yeah, pity doesn't pity doesn't reset on wishes, so that's something that's quite nice. So if we go to the wish screen, da -da -da. if I was to get a five star anywhere along this bar, let's say my next wish got me a five star. Actually, it wasn't red. There you go. Two wishes. Have I got a count on here? Yeah, twelve of eighty. Okay, let's say uh, I'll do a wish now. A oh, lovely uh, battery. Uh, let's do another one. Let's skip that one. Oh, lovely, a piece of trash. Uh, but if I was to get, because uh, that's only 14 of 80, I'm not going to you till 80, but let's say I was to get a five star anywhere at all along here, it doesn't reset, so I'm still guaranteed one at 80. So if you get one at 20, you'll still get one at 80. So that's quite nice. Uh, what's even nicer than that is these things here. I prefer these ones. Uh, you, can, you can buy things and shop with them. Now what can you buy? Anything useful? <laughs> you bet. Uh, what I mean by that is, you can buy extra copies of your weapons and characters, which are the same thing, don't forget. So, if we go to this one here, I think it is. No, it's not. It's this one here. Uh, here is my Chakram of the Seas, which is Shiro. I've managed to get her leveled up so far because I bought these in the shop. You'll see that they cost 120 of these. I've already got 30. Every time you do a pull, you get one of these, regardless of what you get. So, I do another... What is that? 90 pulls. I do another 90 pulls. I can buy an extra copy of a character and weapon set. Five star. If I only want four stars, I can get them for 35. I could get one in five pulls if I wanted. All right, so these are your daily tasks, right? This is the one I told you you get a free wish. I told you. You didn't believe me. You didn't believe me. See? One of these. You just get one of these every day. And the, the best part is you don't even have to do all four of these bounties. You just have to do one. First of all, it asks you which world you want to do it in. Do you want to do it in old world or new world? We'll say new world because we're in new world right now and it'll be closer. And then you just scroll and say, oh, you're the one with the golden egg. All right. So then you could just say, well, bugger these purple eggs. They're not as good. They're not as fun. You can get SSRs on purple eggs, by the way. I've had a couple. They are rare, but you can get them. Yes, I've had SSRs on the purple banner. Something else worth noting, but not very often. Uh, so I could just say, well, I'll bugger you. I'll just do this one then and then get my free gold wish. And that's literally all you have to do to get a free gold wish every day. But do you see any currency on any of these? No. Do you see them anywhere else? No, I'm telling you, there's no... I mean, yes, yeah, it is there, but this one's a bit of a... It's not really misleading, but it's like... This one is like basically a ticky box, right? World exploration means... You've got to hit this percentage of exploration to claim these rewards. And then, oh, you only get two pulls when you get all the way to 1,905. Now, I'm bear in mind, I'm level 60-something, and I'm only here. So that's a lot of world exploration to get to here, to get 300 and get two pulls. So, yeah, again, like, daily bounty, easy wish. Takes me, like, two minutes. Just go and kill some thugs, and you're done. But getting to here and getting 300 currency, I can only do it once, and I still haven't done it. And then once it's gone, it's gone. So it's just a lot harder to get that stuff. It definitely is. So anyway, my name is Captain Corbium. Hope you learned something. Hope it was helpful. If you have any questions, drop by on my Twitch, maybe. Just pop a question in my chat. And I'll, I'll answer it. I'll read it. I'll answer it. Why not? What have I got to lose? I don't care. I might not give you the right answer. Might not be of any use, might not help you, but I'll answer. Alright, I'll leave it there. Bye.